you ever stop and think about where your life's going? We don't do this most of the time, and it'd be hardly healthy if we did. We can't conduct a full inquiry into our existence every morning when we get out of bed. But most people do stop and think about their lives from time to time. We pause and we take our bearings. Is life where I thought it would be right now? Is there some sort of overriding purpose? Where's it all going? Where am I going? Of course, there's a really good reason for stopping to ponder the course of our lives. It's the wonderful possibility that our lives do in fact have a profound purpose, that we were made by God for a reason. And if that was the case, wouldn't you want to discover that reason and that purpose and live the rest of your life pursuing it? Well, that's what the course of your life is really about. It's an opportunity for you to pause and take the temperature of your life, to think about who you are and why God put you here on this planet. More specifically, the course of your life is designed to help you achieve three things. Firstly, to understand afresh who God is, what he's doing in our world, and what Jesus has to do with that. Secondly, to see and understand yourself afresh, who you really are, what you're here for, what your future holds. And thirdly, on the basis of both of these things, to discover what God wants you to do with the rest of your life. From this point on, not just vaguely, generally, be a good Christian, give God the glory, but more personally and specifically. Now the course can be done in a number of ways and over a number of different lengths of time. Your course leader will talk with you about those details. But essentially, there are three components. There are seminars, which run for around 90 minutes each, in which we dig into the Bible together and see what God is saying to us. Then there are one-to-one -one meetings where we get together with someone else in the course to read the Bible and to pray together. And finally, towards the end of the course, there's an intensive where over a weekend or on some consecutive Saturdays, we draw the threads together and take some time to think through the implications for ourselves. So it's not a small commitment. It will take some time and some effort. But these are hardly small or casual subjects we're discussing. We're pausing in the midst of our busy lives to delve into what God has to say about the purpose and meaning and direction of our lives. And there's every chance that as a result, your life will never be the same again. I'd really encourage you, take this opportunity to consider the course of your life.